Hey everybody, today we're going to be working on balance and flexibility. We're going to do that through a series of partner challenges. Just like with any of our workouts, make sure you get in a good warm up first. We've already warmed up, so we're ready to show you. Our first one was inspired by the fifth graders. Last year they did the turtle um, dance that they did together, or performance. Um, so first person is going to come down on their knees and get into child's pose. So they're down, stretching out, and then the next person is going to be the top of the turtle, and they're going to lay back, trying not to knock heads, and stretching out and finding balance. Very good. <laughs> awesome. Very good. Okay, next one is up tall. You're going to make a skyscraper, so their hands are going to come up above their heads. They're going to lean in, and you can see if you can take a step back even to make it a little bit harder and lean in for that balance. Great. Okay, next one is sit down. We're gonna make a boat. <laughs> All right. For double boat, you're gonna start seated with your feet together, um, and then you're gonna try to raise up your legs together, still oh, no. keeping your feet together. And if you're really good, or maybe similar in size, you can pick up your hands and raise your feet a little higher and try to reach towards your partner's hand. <laughs> so raise up and try to reach towards their hands. For another seated one, you're going to keep your feet together, just like for the boot, but this one's called seesaw, and you're going to try to reach out towards your partner's hands, and you're going to see saw, see saw. <laughs> you might need to bend your knees just a little bit to get a little more stretch, especially if you're not the same height as your partner. Next, we'll try a double candlestick. So a candlestick, I mean, you want to show them. So you're going to lay on your back, and you're going to try to roll back, push back up towards your shoulders, and lift your hips up off the ground. Now they're going to try double candlestick. All right, and so they're going to see if they can get their feet to touch for a double candlestick. With this move and all the moves, just make sure that you're breathing. You're really exhaling on the top of the movement. So... The squeeze, the muscle squeeze of the movement, you're exhaling. Okay, this one is double downward dog. So I know you know downward dog. So you're gonna start like that, and then one partner is gonna put their feet up on the other partner's I'm the shoulders. I'm the little, so I'm gonna do this. <laughs> All right, so and see if you can hold that balance. You can also try to flatten out and make it into a centipede. So drop your hips down, guys, drop your hips down. There you go, into a centipede. Good balance, or right, you can come off. Our last one, this one's a bit of a challenge. You're gonna sit back to back, you're gonna link your arms, and you're gonna try to stand up without using your arms to push you up off the ground. Ready, go. Woo, we've been working on it for a little while. But um, at the end, you could just finish up with some of your favorite yoga moves. Bye. Have a great day. Bye.